What I need you, you guys to stop doing and all you got all you males out here, stop looking at females with lust, bro. That's what you need to do. Stop looking at females with lust. What I do, because I've retained for two and a half years, I can tell you right now that I don't look at females as lust, bro. I don't look at them for like sex like sex. That's what that's what happens, bro. When you retain for a long period of time, the beauty of it, bro, you don't have you don't look at females for sex. And when you don't look at the females for sex, you just look at them for this them. And it just feels much greater, bro. Like, it feels great not just wanting to this. That's just leading my lust, bro. Because that's what most of you guys do out here. You just look at females as sexual objects. And that's why they don't even fuck you in the first place, bro. Literally. And now that I look at females at a dis different way, literally, they'll, they'll look at me differently because I'm, I respect them, bro. Literally. That's what I mean, bro. You just got to... Show respect though, I'm telling you. And you'll get, most of the time, you'll just get what you want. But yeah, goddamn, man. That's. That's what I realized that. Like, you don't look, as I said, bro, you don't look at females for this, the, the cat, bro. You just look at them for the beauty, like, on the inside and the outside, bro. Literally. And you just look at females for what they are, bro. Like, literally, you don't think a female's ugly or, like, nice or nothing, bro. Like, you just look at them for them because you don't look at them as a sexual object. Like, that's why, that's why I feel like it's the best to practice semen retention because you won't think we are lost and you're, and you're, you know what I mean? You won't think of lust, bro. Literally, when you think of lust, that's when you end up in bad situations. You end up with babies, all these baby mothers that you don't even pay for them you don't even want to even have the baby but you know this because you're thinking when you're lost bro and you're not thinking long term you just want to get it in and then get out the door bro but you haven't thought about what baggage you left with that woman bro and that's what i mean like some of you guys really need to think about what you're doing to these females bro literally you're leaving these females with all these kids and stuff making it raise them on their own like if you're not if you're not ready to sign up for the job then don't do it bro literally wear protection bro literally that's what i'm just gonna t try to tell you bro literally don't be going raw with these females and going crazy bro because you're just gonna end up going too crazy and you are gonna get a child bro literally you don't want to end up with a child especially if you're young you don't want to be end up with children when you're young bro you want to be living life going on holiday doing all this extra stuff Man, we gotta be living, bro. We need to be making money. Ditchy, in our twenties, we need to be making money, bro. Money, money making in the twenties, and nothing else, bro. We need to be looking at the bigger picture. My phone died, but yeah, we need to be making money in our twenties and doing bigger things, bro. Because what you gotta understand, the the more you focus on your life and when you're young, is the better, bro. You don't want to be wasting your life. I'm telling you, bro. That's why I'm so happy I found this self improvement path from young. From young bro, imagine if I went through all of my twenties not not knowing not knowing who my true calling, not knowing who I'm what, what I'm meant to be doing, and just going throughout all these years just wasting time, bro. I'm so happy I found this self improvement path and I found God and I got rid of all these people bro. But yeah, um God damn Females. Yeah bro. You just gotta really Yeah, bro, in our 20s, we need to be making money. And my phone died, and I hate it, and I'm gonna, but I'm gonna still continue. But yeah, um, yeah, bro, like, don't be thinking when you're lost your females because that's when you get disrespected, bro. Like, I'm telling you, like, you guys out here love to take disrespect from women all the time, uh, females ending calls on you, not messaging you back. You just keep pursuing them and they don't even want you. Uh, what else you got? Um, you know what I mean, bro? You simping, spending all your money, wasting their time on all these dates, all these dinner dates, with a fuck box that literally after that dinner date, you'll go meet someone else because she knows you're a loser, bro. I'm telling you, like, most of these females know you guys are losers, bro, and you, like, you don't get many other females, bro, and you just do anything for that one. That's what I, really, that's what I mean, bro. That's just why you need to 
fix your own life before you start to go out there in the in the, in the world and looking for females, bro. This is this is what I this is why I started. This is why I'm so happy I started my self improvement path right now because in a couple when I'm really set, bro, I can be going out here smashing every female out here, bro. Literally, and that time will come because. My stuff, my, my shit will be together soon, bro. Literally, I've been doing it for two and a half years and I'm going to keep doing it until it is, it is really set, bro. And now I'm going to keep pushing myself because I'm very motivated, bro, literally. <laughs> uh, and literally, most people don't have motivation, motivation because they've got low self-esteem. And yeah, bro, this is why I need to practice seeing my attention to get high self-esteem. <laughs> uh, yeah, man. But yeah, stop, folks. Yeah. Don't use your lust, bro. Lust, that's why it gets you in bad situations, man. Child support, all this extra stuff. And this gets you a whole heap of headache, bro, literally. You're spending all this money when you don't even want to spend it, bro. When you can be spending it on, I don't know, bro, something much more constructive, bro, than a female. God damn. Because females know who they can disrespect and who they can't disrespect, bro. Like... That's why they go to, that's why they just take your money. That's that's why they go to all these rappers and all these, um, all these entertainers, go take their money because they love to flash it, bro. Literally, people that flash their money, bro, they get used because they use that as their personal. Because they have no personality, bro. They use their money as to fill that, like that void, bro. So that's how people are perceived, like. Females only perceive them, like, look at them for the money, bro. They're like, oh, this guy's got money. Let me let me try to get in with him because he's got money. And this is why I tell you, you got to watch out, bro, because most time these females aren't even in, in it for you, bro. They're just in it for what they can benefit off you, goddamn man. Ah! And yeah. Oh, my back. But goddamn, bro. Times will get... Yeah, that's what, that's what I mean. Like, you just got to chase the back, bro. Let you chase the back and don't look back, bro. Don't look back until you... Don't um, don't be looking for no females until you've got your life set. That's all I have to say to you, bro. Don't be looking for females until you've got your life set and you got all your priorities straight because if you bring a female into your life and you don't have your, your shit set and let's just say you're having all this, all this sex... You're having all of this extra shit and you don't even have like no money you have no money so if you're smashing females and you have no money you're just what kind of lifestyle are you going back to you're just going if you're going back to a lifestyle where you, you do have nothing going for you then you're just make you're lowering yourself even more like you gotta understand yeah pleasure is great but make sure you have pleasure like you can have pleasure once you get your shit set bro Literally, I get pleasure out of this lifting weights, bro. Literally, yeah. that's why I get pleasure out of, bro. Goddamn, man. But yeah, bro, like, you, some, that's what I mean. Like, some of you got to look at the bigger picture in life, bro, and stop thinking, like, about all your friends and all your, all these people around you because at certain points in life, people won't be there for you and you're going to have to be on your own and that's where most people suffer. Like, they try to call up on people. Oh, can you help me with this? Can you help me with that? And no one will come to you and because... That's the, that's just how you gotta go through it sometimes, you know what I mean? And that's why you gotta be alone sometimes to really know yourself and to over like overcome things, bro. Fears everything. And it's your demons in general, you need to conquer your demons and fight your demons, bro. Literally demons are something you have to fight. Because if you don't fight your demons then you're gonna stay in that same spot until you don't until you elevate bro but yeah goddamn man focus on the money man focus for the young guys out there um for i don't care how young you are from the younger for the younger the better the younger the better the more you focus in your life from when you're young and the longer you go and you become sex like successful oh you can be smashing all the females bro and yeah you don't have to be going out here and spending all your money on them. On them. They'll just come to you, bro. But don't be wasting, yeah, as I said, bro. Don't be spending time on your fem females because 
you will spend all this time getting all these phone numbers and all this extra stuff and you know, getting on all of these dates and all these bills with them and then in the end what have you really got out of it ask yourself what have you really got out of it like what have you really got out of all that sex bro nowhere like you're just still in the same spot doing nothing bro wasting all that energy where you could be wasting that on a lot of other things to help yourself like you gotta understand bro every time you release you're leaving you're releasing a part of you that's what i realized your sexual energy is really powerful bro like it creates a child you know what i mean it creates a child and that's why you can't be releasing it like that that's why once i realized like once i retained for a long time i realized how powerful like your seed is and how much you shouldn't be releasing it like that bro because now i realize it's valuable bro literally now i know it's very valuable and you don't want to waste it on just nothing and for all you guys that actually that's for another video but yeah stay tuned stay tuned take it easy and i'm out